it's been a decade, but the pain is still there. Right? The pain is still here. It's, it's, it's a shame that you, we have to keep going and keep fighting. We shouldn't have to be the grievers and the investigators. Uh, we doing their jobs and doing something that they are trying to cover up. Uh, you know, people been saying for a long time, if Kendrick was a white child, would this have would have happened? How can you let a child go to school and disappear in your school and nothing be done about it? Y'all continue to lie to the parents. You continue to lie, continue to lie, and continue to lie. Uh, we shouldn't have to go through this, but we are willing to go how, however far it takes for us to get the truth out. And what has the past uh, years been like for you, having to fight this at the same time mourning the loss of your child? It's painful, it's hurtful. It's a shame that we have been having to fight for 10 and a half long years and nobody seems to care about Kendrick. He's just another child that they just want to sweep under the rug. But as I always tell them, they killed the wrong child, but they got the right parents because we're going to continue to keep fighting for Kendrick because his life matter. Well, what happens next? You won't follow these documents today? Yeah. Um, the defendants have 21 days from time of receipt uh, of, of the, the complaint to respond. They can deny everything there or they can file some type of a motion, uh, presumably to dismiss because they don't want to they don't want to uh, deal with this evidence in court. And under Georgia law, unfortunately for the sheriff, they have no immunity. Immunity isn't even a question in this case. Talk about the deposition that you said brought up some of this information. What else that from that deposition that made you say we have to do this? Well, for starting out, so I've been I've been with them almost the entire time, uh, mo mostly in the background. And uh, what happened, brother Brother Johnson asked me at the 10th annual um, march, the memorial uh, of of Kendrick. Hey, you know, can you can you can can you look into this? And so when I started looking into the pictures and everything, and then I looked at the synopsis, there's, for example, two shoes in the mat that supposedly Kendrick was reaching for when he fell. Well, the evidence that they collected and all the statements that they made to the press was it was one shoe, right? So. The second shoe was some place way over here, but in the synopsis, it had the two shoes together. So clearly they fabricated the diagram in the synopsis because there weren't two shoes together. And there's another shoe there, you know, the one where they have uh, the one shoe next to a pool of blood with Kendrick's hair over. Well, where the second shoe? if? The synopsis diagram has the two shoes side by side. There's also the absence of blood on both of these shoes. If Kendrick was over top of the shoes, like the synopsis says, and blood drips down, then there should be blood on top of the shoes. There's absence of blood from both of the shoes, one here, one way over there. Those are just a couple of the things. There's a lot more, but when you look at that, that's materially false information. So when Dr. Kraft testified in her deposition that they, he was reaching for two shoes and the sheriff said there's only one shoe, that's a material falsehood. And in your opinion, clear evidence of conspiracy and cover-up? Clearly. There's no question about it. No question whatsoever. What are your thoughts on Sheriff Polk in general and his findings that he's saying is accidental? He's a, he's a liar. I'm going to call him for just what he is. He's a liar. And this, this, um, it ain't just, it's not just Kendrick's case that Polk um, fabricated a lot over. We, we have. I think they want you to. Oh, no, she died. Oh, okay. We have, we have, it's other cases there that truth has not been told about. Kendrick's case is just more. So we live there, we know how this, this town is. 
we know how they'll lie, we know how they'll cover up for one another. But we are a family that's going to continue to go and continue to push for the truth. Uh, we know the truth there, and we, that's all we're going to do. We're going we're gonna to continue to push for the truth, and we're going to continue to put evidence out that we find. Can you believe he was murdered? I know he was murdered. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You said Appreciate lawsuit it. is the proper terminology? Or? It is a $1 billion lawsuit. lawsuit.